This rest area has potable water and a water fountain, which is really nice. I think I'll get a drink. How about that? <laughs> Quick stop at this little rest area. Bathrooms, a little water fountain, but swing around. This little outbuilding behind me, we're gonna go test. It's got some electrical receptacles, so we're gonna uh, we're gonna test them to see if it's got any power. No power, Adam. Uh, so don't get your hopes up. But uh, yeah, we'll swing around for just a second. There's your car parking, semi truck parking. If you stay here, you will have to deal with road noise. But the uh, view is pretty cool out here. There's a little Department of Transportation road maintenance station there, but uh, they've got picnic tables, another power outlet that's been disabled. No power, no power, no power, but uh, farmland, farmland and the hills in the background. Not bad for a one night stop, but we're not staying. But I'll go ahead and link this to the, uh, be linked in the description below. Let's head down the road. Looks like I might be sharing the road with somebody up here. That black spot. Right there. Hey! Hey, come here! I want to talk to you! Come here, bud! This looks like a campground. That looks like a camp host. There's some kind of bulletin board over there. I have to walk over and see what it says. This would officially be the campground. Walk around and read this. Info! Fishing things. Closed Sunday, May 18th, 2021. I think that's a little old. And here's a little map. You can read that through the tree reflection. Campground rules. Minimum of 100 feet between camps. See if I can focus in on that. There you go. If anyone wants to read that. Pause that along the way. And it talks to you about fish, things like that. I don't see any fees or anything of the sort. There are several pit toilets, and you get a barbecue grill and a little wind block to go over your uh, park bench. Kind of look across and a few different toilets and campgrounds here. Few trees. They're bare because it's winter. That's just how that is. There is a water spigot. It's not a. It's like a shared type thing. And then up here you got a little scrub brush chain to this. There's some water. I don't know how clear that looked, but it's water. There's a second water spigot where that is and there's actually an RV dump station at this location that's pretty cool
Now it's warm springs. I need a haircut and a shit. Wow. There's also a boat launch and another restroom down here by the lake. Let's pan around real quick and take a look at the view. It is uh, another beautiful day and uh, we're going to head down the road. I will link to uh, this location here, the campsite and the hot springs and in case uh, weather's bad because you do have the, the road to come in oh yeah the uh, south entrance to here there's two there's a north and a south the south entrance is a lot better a lot drier road and but uh yeah i'll link to all of that and also the rest stop of the road just in case this is too far off the beaten path for you or if it's uh, inclement weather or whatever it's just not a good not a good uh good stop but uh yeah if you uh, if you want to you can follow along like, subscribe, any of that good fun stuff. See, uh, see what kind of interesting places we can find next. Let's go.